Have you ever wondered how a welding transformer with variable amperage works through the mechanical adjustment of a magnetic shunt? Well, now I'm going to show you. Now this is a welding transformer, a variable, a variable amperage uh, welding transformer. And you have here your two windings, your primary and your secondary. And in the middle, you have what's called the magnetic shunt, this here. And it's adjusted in and out, by screwing in and out, and it uh, interferes with the, um, the uh, uh, magnetic field. Now, just to show you how this works, I'm going to take the top off this because I can split this one in two. Now, this is how the magnetic shunt works. Okay? So screw it in and out. And when it's fully out, as you can see it's going out now, and when it's fully out, you have the highest amperage. Because it's interfering less with the uh, metal core. It'll come right out. You can see yourself get the adjustment right out on it. Now there you are, you see. That's the highest amperage, right? Because it's not interfering at all with the the core of the um, transformer. When you screw all the way back in, that will give you the lowest amperage. And that's how these um, uh, magnetic shunt works. The ma magnetic shunts work. They just interfere with the magnetic field between the two windings. But they are a much better option than um, having you know uh, set amperages on small machines you're much better off being able to adjust it with one of these so if you're getting a welder get one with a magnetic shunt